Good evening, friends. Today we will learn how to retrieve your data from the MySQL database into your Java code. For that, open your NetBeans and uh, make this type of uh, JFrame that we have made already in the previous video. And there are six labels and six text fields. And there are two buttons submit and retrieve. And in this video, we are going to retrieve our data. So we will use this one button. And uh, for that, uh, for the retrieval of your data, we need some basis that is on the on what basis we are going to retrieve our data. So in this, I will retrieve the data on the basis of the username that user will give. And for that, click on the retrieve button. Right click, click on events, action, and action. And here we will write the code. Just see it. Here we will get the username that user will enter. And store it in a variable that is user. And now we are going to make the connection with our database. So that we are making connection class. And also, just to make it more set. And after that, drag block. And here is the name of your database that is user. And the user name of the database and the password. After this, we have to make statement. Here we will write the select query. That is select to start from our table name. That is user detail. Where here we will write the condition that is our user name, which the user will enter. And now we will check whether we have done something or not by using the next method. And if it is true, okay. and inside this. If the next method runs some value, that means there are some values which have username similar to the you know, username given by the user. So here we will write ext open set text and here we will write rs string and here is the column name. Password that is password. Similar with all the other text fields.
this will set all the text fields with the values and now we will do that. We have to close to the section that we had opened. So like this we have to write this code.
Okay. Now, again, okay. and this, this time to do work, definitely work. In this way, you can drive your data from your database. Thanks for watching this video. Have a nice day.